Hello everyone, in this video I'll show you how to create a beautiful cross stitch pattern that's simple and quick to make. Knowing what materials we all need before starting a project is always helpful. A yarn size 4 or medium and a 5mm hook is an excellent choice for this project. In choosing a color that you love will make the finished product even more special. Now if you are ready, let's begin. First, make a slip knot and count your foundation chains using an odd number. On this project, I use 23 chains for my sample, but you can adjust the length as required. Once you have made your chains, insert your hook in the fifth chain of the first row. One, two, three, four, and five. And work a double crochet across each stitch. Those three chains right there is counted as one double crochet. Now go ahead and make your double crochet in every stitches all the way to the last stitch of this row. And now you have completed the first row. Now it's time to start the second row. Make a chain of three and turn your work. We will now work between the double crochet stitches. Skip three double crochet and make a double crochet. Then skip double crochet backwards and make another double crochet. Now we are done with the first cross stitch pattern. Then we're gonna skip two double crochet. Then make a double crochet. Again, skip two double crochet backward right here and make new double crochet. Now we have two cross stitch pattern right here. I'll show you one more time. Skip double crochet forward and make double crochet and then skip two double crochet backward then make another double crochet again one more time skip two double crochet forward and make your double crochet and repeat skip two double crochet backward and do a new double crochet repeat this pattern across the row making a cross stitch pattern and then make a regular double crochet on the last stitch on the third chain of your stitch. And now you have completed the second row. For the third row, repeat the pattern of the second row. However, it's much easier now because we are only working on this basis. Start with a chain of three and turn your work. Follow the spaces and create your cross stitch pattern. Then make a double crochet on the last stitch of the row.
now we are moving into the fourth row so let's start making a chain of three one two three and repeat the pattern of the first row which is a double crochet across every stitch Now, once you are done, ensure that you have the same number of stitches as the first row. This will ensure that you get everything right. By following these simple steps, you can confidently create a beautiful cross stitch pattern. To do the fifth row, let's start making a chain of three. Then repeat the pattern we use on the second row. So start by skipping three double crochet initially, then make a new double crochet. So skip double crochets. Then another two double crochet backward and make another double crochet. So repeat this pattern across the row in creating a cross stitch pattern so skip two double crochet forward and make a double crochet and then skip another two double crochet backward and make a new double crochet again skip double crochet forward make your double crochet and skip two double crochet backward and do your new double crochet skip two double crochet forward again and then two double crochet backward and make a new double crochet so as you notice right here our previous cross stitch pattern is the same line with our new cross stitch pattern and lastly make double crochet on top of your previous double crochet then on the sixth row we could effortlessly repeat the pattern from row three with these skills there's no doubt that you'll be able to complete any pattern in a chip the desired size the cross stitch pattern may appear confusing to some but anyone can produce beautiful and intricate work with the guidance and expertise this video is informative, engaging, and packed with valuable tips on crocheting. Please share it with as many people as possible and leave a comment to let others know how it has helped you. Remember to subscribe to my channel to learn more about crocheting. Keep up the fantastic work. Happy crochet, everyone!